Millions of Americans abuse prescription drugs, particularly opioids, and thousands die from overdoses each year. Dependence on these drugs has a number of effects on your body. Misuse of prescription drugs can mask or numb emotions, making the person appear flat. Abusers often see changes in sleeping habits, resulting in an increased or decreased need for sleep. Those misusing prescription drugs may have an increased or decreased appetite. Abusers can suffer from nausea, headache, or dizziness. And even a single misuse can lead to severe respiratory depression, resulting in death. What's the first step you should take if you believe you have a problem with misusing prescription drugs? Uh, well, the first step is going to depend on uh, the circumstances that we see people in a variety of situations. There's some people that are, you know, buying prescription drugs illegally that are very uh, clear that they're addicted to the drugs and that they're uh, using them just because they like the way they feel. And then kind of at the other end of the spectrum, there's people who really are taking unnecessary prescription drugs that they believe are necessary. And there's a lot of times a, a, a lot of denial and justification and rationalization. And, you know, we'll sometimes see people that are on uh, a, a slew of different sedative and painkilling medications and really they're functioning far worse than they ever were before they were on those things, but they're insisting that they need those medications in order to function. Um, so for those people, they, they um, may not even be honest yet. So I think first is to take an honest look at the situation and uh, get feedback and listen to feedback from other people in your life and uh, trusted loved ones, family, friends. If, if other people are um, suggesting that there may be a problem, then it's uh, probably time to listen and take an honest look. Uh, the most available resource for anyone if they're looking for some help with a drug problem would be to go to 12-step meetings. Um, in our community we have uh, lots of NA meetings, Narcotics Anonymous for people with any sort of addiction problem, and uh, a variety of different AA Alcoholics Anonymous meetings. These meetings are free to attend and, and uh, widely available, so as far as uh, accessible treatment, that's definitely the best way to go. Uh, if somebody questions whether they need more intensive treatment, if they think that they may need detox or they need professional counseling or assistance, then I'd suggest they contact the Anderson Center for an assessment. Uh, we do free assessments so they can meet with a licensed therapist who will review their story and, and make a recommendation. Uh, in some cases, we recommend people come into the hospital in order to safely get detoxified from whatever it is they're using. 